Good morning, everybody. So there has been a decision in Adam Montgomery appearing in court for his sentencing. So the judge did rule that he does have to repair his sentencing. Convicted murderer Adam Montgomery is scheduled for sentencing on May 9th on the most serious charges brought against him in connection to the death of his daughter, Harmony. During his most recent trial, he faced charges of second-degree murder, falsifying physical evidence, abuse of a corpse, and witness tampering. Montgomery chose not to attend the lengthy trial in Hillsborough County Superior Court. The jury was told to consider his absence in their fight not to consider his absence in their findings mcgarry was found guilty and faces life in prison in connection to the most recent convictions mcgarry is currently in new hampshire state prison for men serving two committed consecutive sentences of 15 to 30 years for each charge of being an armed career criminal followed by an additional consecutive stand committed sentence of seven and a half to 15 for the remaining charges with five years at the minimum sentence suspended. In the aggregate, the defendant's sentence maintains a minimum of 32 years, according to the New Hampshire Attorney General's office. After being found guilty of the most recent charges, Montgomery's attorney, Caroline Smith, requested that Montgomery not be present in the courtroom during sentencing and the filing. He asked to waive his appearance because he maintains his innocence of murder, tampering with a witness, and second degree assault. On Friday, Amy Messer, who has proceeded over the trial, ruled Montgomery must appear in court for the sentencing, agreeing with prosecutors he had no legal right to skip the sentencing. Messer cited state law SRA 6514-A, which states the defendant shall personally appear in court when the victim or victim's next of kin addresses the judge, unless excused by the court. The court does not find that the defendant has raised an adequate factual or legal basis to do. The defendant has been found guilty beyond a reasonable doubt by a jury as to those charges Messer wrote. At the sentencing at 1 p.m. on May 9th, many family members of Harmony Montgomery are anticipated to share victim impact statements. So he didn't get his way, which is good. He has to face Crystal, I believe Harmony's foster mom and Blair M Miller. So, and I think he should, but I wanted to give you guys that update and thank you guys for watching. Remember as always to hit the like button, comment below and share out. Have a great day. Bye guys.